In this video, I will demonstrate the final product. The AWS IoT button is now controlling my LifeX light based on three event types, click, double click, and long click. Each click event type is assigned to a scene on my light based on the AWS LifeX control panel application that we ran earlier. I can rerun and reassign those scenes as often as I like. When the button is clicked, the script gets the list of lights that belong to the scene and then checks their status. If one or more lights in that scene are currently on, then the scene is considered active. If the scene is active, all lights are then turned off. If all of the lights in the scene are off, then the scene is activated. With this behavior, the button acts as a toggle switch to turn the lights on and off. I will now demonstrate the three event types. First up is the single click. I simply push the button once and wait. The light on the button will flash white while it is working and then green to indicate success or red to indicate that it failed. It's hard to see the color of the light on this video, so I'll let you know when it flashes green. And the green flash is right there. And there we see the light come on. I'll push the button again to turn the light off. Notice the light is white with 10% intensity, just like we defined in our single click scene. And now the light is off. Next up is the double click. I will click the button twice. If you caught that, it flashed red. This does not happen very often. In fact, this is the first time I've seen it fail. Let's try that again. That time we got the green flash. The light is now blue at 10% intensity. It's hard to see on the video, so I'll shut the backlight off for a few seconds. Let's go ahead and shut it off. Notice I only clicked it once. This works because all of my scenes use the same light. If the scenes were assigned to different lights, I would have to double click to turn this one off. There's the green flash. And now it's off. I'll turn the backlight back on. Last up is the long click. I will hold the button down a little longer this time. There's the green flash. Now the light is on with the color red, just as we defined in our long click scene. Again, I'll turn the backlight off to see the color. One last time, I click the button to turn the light off. There's the green flash. And it's off. Hopefully you noticed each time the light turned on and off, it transitioned or faded. This is controlled by the duration setting in the application. That's the demonstration. I hope this inspires you to get the button and some LifeX lights of your own. Enjoy.